rule number one. If you cannot win the derby, don't lose it. Um, I think we could have won it today, but we could have lost in a few moments as well. If you count the amount of chances we had and the amount of chances they had, then we would have probably deserved, would have been a preserved winner. I think that we had the last chance, which was a massive one, we could have won there, absolutely. But they had. Uh, Ali had to make two incredible saves and just called a goal, which was disallowed for a small offside, but obviously offside. Um, so, intense like always. Um, and we were ready to fight after a super intense game on Wednesday. Um, we, we tried to fight, and especially then, of course, um, second half, um, it was it looked like an end-to-end -end game because after our set pieces, they we didn't defend the second balls that particularly well. We had good set pieces, but when the set piece we didn't finish it off, or we got another one, then we were slightly too open. That they used that in these moments pretty well. Apart from that, they didn't cause us a lot of problems or whatever. Um, but yeah, we had to dig in deep. Obviously, that's what we did. Uh, that's it. Bad, not I think, not bad. I think um, extremely painful. It's a dead leg on the muscle above the knee, and he couldn't bend the knee anymore. So because of this muscle swells up, and then there's no space for anything else. And um, we have now to see how, how quickly that will settle. But it's um, you could see he tried, but you could see he couldn't run properly. We just waited for half time and made them the change with Bobby. No. Sorry, sorry. Work, no? Again. Mo Salah's spending quite a lot of time out wide, possibly away from the goal, even though he'll get a chance later on. Is that, is that by accident or design? <laughs> no, it's not more than other seasons or whatever. I'm not sure if you what you see there. It's. Um, we don't want to have. We want to have more than this position, but we want to have more in. in we always had him more often in central positions as well. Um, today, especially, we wanted to use the voice a bit more centrally, um, but didn't have a lot of time to train. Obviously, actually, we only recovered. Um, spoke a lot about it. I'm not sure I was clear enough um, in the first half uh, what we what we exactly wanted. Um, in the moments when we played, if when Mo dropped or, or Lucho dropped um, after two or three passes, they were completely free in between the lines because Darwin kept the last line back with his pure presence and they liked to drop pretty early. But we didn't do that often enough, we <laughs> were uh, right. So I don't think in this season he's too often wide, maybe today in a few moments, yes, but in general um, he could have scored again. The, the, well, in the last minute, pretty much, that was him, I think, and um, so, yeah, that's it. James? Yeah, just like the minute you took Trent off today, was that purely tactical, or is it you looking like just a manager's game time at the moment? What's the thing behind that? Yeah, we have to. So where can we change in a moment? So with the players coming in, coming back. So Arthur is now there, here. It's really good and very important for us. But he didn't play football for a long, long time and played yesterday a rondo with us. So we thought actually until last night that he will not be um, available. But now he was in the squad, but it was not a plan to bring him. So who do we have them on the bench? So yes, Mili can play in midfield and on and, and both fullback positions. And we just thought, again, like in the last game, it makes sense to bring the fresh legs there. Um, and that's why we decided it like this. Trent is playing all the time, Rob is playing all the time, and if you them from time to time, and that's in a moment, there we have alternatives. That's why we have to use them to bring fresh energy on the pitch. Pretty much has nothing to do with performances, even when I know that Trent can play better than today, definitely. Um, but there's nothing to do with that. It's just we have to get through this period, how it is, um, because yes, players are coming back, but they have to be reintegrated. Um, and you cannot just bring them in and play them 90 minutes or whatever, that's not possible. And that's why uh, we have, need to have a look where can we do some, um, where can we do the changes and give the game um, new or more dynamic again. Tom? Uh, yeah, so um, when the goals come outside, you seem to be an object, fly down and hit you. 
No, I didn't see it. I thought it was a, it was a glass bottle, but it was not. I, th I saw it now because it's still at the yeah. crime scene. <laughs> no, no, it was a plastic bottle. In a moment, I, it looked like like a, a glass bottle. That would have been really dangerous, but it was not as a plastic bottle, so uh, no. Dave, last one. Yeah. Darwin Nunes on another day, he, I mean, he, he, I mean, maybe eight chances and he could have had that trip. I just wonder, is that, um, is that an issue? No. Me, or, or it's a, it's it? in the agency, it is, what is that, the start stop integration now. So that's how it is. We play all the time. That means we cannot train constantly. He was suspended in a, in a week where we had two, three normal-ish sessions. The rest was individual when he had to do a little bit more and stuff like this. In the sessions when we had them, he looked really good, but he still has to re be integrated. That's completely normal. So the way we play, it's now not that we create the guy, the balls. When, yeah, we had a chance. There was, I think, one where we passed the ball back and it was open goal. I'm not a big for still there, but it, I know that he will score in these moments in the in, in the future. That's clear. Um, but it was super intense for him today. Super. And we had to make the decision. Bobby was injured before, so now played two games or three games. Really, really, really good. Um, and Wednesday, Saturday, traditionally um, difficult, difficult. Um, um, fixtures, and so that's why we decided we let, we let Darwin start, and he came through 80 minutes, and he, he can score. No, it's not a concern or whatever. It's just a situation, and it's all fine uh, for the moment. And that, in that perspective, we just have to, to, to. And if we would have played our absolute best football game ever on on Wednesday night, and maybe we did that at once, once or twice before a derby, we still arrived here and was this kind of game. Um, and so nobody should be now too surprised. Last year it looked slightly different because we scored in the right moments. We didn't do that today. That's why they could stay in the game. And they are a different team to last year as well. So they have the, the idea they have um, is obviously not a bad one. They defend pretty, pretty well, and then the counter attacks are a real threat. Um, and that's it. So um, I, there are not a lot of derbies that will be in my the book of games. Which I will watch back again so in the future. So um, one or two maybe, but all the others not, just because it's never really outstanding football. It's a big fight. What everybody expects from both teams. We fought, didn't play always extremely well, but created enough top chances. Didn't use them. And we cannot score. But how I said, if you can't win the derby, don't lose it. <laughs>